It's a rainy and grungy day here at Muddy Hard Crash Field in Micro Hard, Washington. It's a perfect sloppy stage for some NFL football or a tribute to Woodstock 94. Both teams hit the field ready to hit each other in this NFL matchup. The Brain Washington Cadavers battle, the Micro Hard Mutilators. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. And MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pig flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but uh, the monsoon mudslide to be done. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally cramping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And it's why he's a defense, schmuck. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. Third down and, and the defense jumps on sides trying to mutilate. If he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, Keska say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? And it's first and ten. Crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What? And kick the kick and shove in half? They just... It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. To the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah. Boom, dead and down. You delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah. Ah. Didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. He's at the 10. And he recovers the fumble and runs it back for a defensive score. That's a backbreaker for the offense. Burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. Yeah. 
And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. And he made a mistake there. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have to made it the dice, Grim. It'd have been fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second and one. Oh, he's going berserk. Ah, and he laterals at the last second. Nifty move there. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. I would have thought you had to have muscles to move like that. Nor a brain or a nervous system, but I see your point, Bricks. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. That's it, fans. My floor wizard vacuum bot has better moves. I think with my vacuum a lot, Grim. That's not wrong, is it? It is when you make it dinner and buy perfume, you pervert. Turner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. It's two 
two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. Third down and, well, good luck. Simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. And that pass play is good for eight yards. Second down and two. Two. Oh man, I love this dirty trick. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Well, that's a strange penalty call right there. I'm starting to notice that these red lights talking, and it don't make much sense. No, but he's making a lot of dollars. <laughs> down and long and they've had enough the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref third down and the qb is saying his prayers I'm taking you with me. The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. And it's first and ten. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. And that's another pick. Man, oh, man, the defense is going to have... Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I got to check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. It's the end of the first quarter, and I just want to say that this is the ugliest thing I've ever seen. Other than my mother-in-law, of course, wearing that moo-moo. Is she going to dry clean that before she gives it back to me? Ah, another interception. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? First and ten. And the D 
defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three win, but my watch is a bit slow. Right, hey. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot two. Oh, great play. He is on that receiver like glue. You know, when I was little, my dad used to make me eat glue. My tongue would get stuck to the roof of my mouth, and I couldn't talk. Your father was a very smart man, Bricks. Very smart. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Third and two. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon rabies blood is my thought. Oh, the player's favorite. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. Hot two. Hot, hot, hot. And this guy just exploded into flames. Now the defense has to try to tackle a running buck. He just put that guy into his misery and says, who's next? Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The 30. The 20. The 10. It's a touchdown! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Second down and ten. You know, this preserve very tricky fair to the QB. It's like Boom to the moon! Another loser fights the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. Is 
running low on blocker. They have only two left. They lose another. It's game over. And it's first and ten. And the defense just knocked the wind out of that quarterback. Second down and more than the QB would like. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. Oh, the defense must have called a hot potato dirty trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping contest. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, what a brutal hit. Second down and long. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. And they went to the air and came up big. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punter. And we're at the two-minute warning. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got an off. That's a decent punt. The return man catches the ball. Boom! And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells... I know how to said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. He's not going down. He just 
put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? He broke free and has open field in front of him. The offense lost another running back and only two remain on their roster. When a team loses all their running backs, they lose their ability to run the ball. Hey, like if I rip out your tongue, you won't be able to speak. Tell us something we don't know, genius. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brick's match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And there's another pick. Man, this quarter. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking at some point they're going to need to put this ref out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks attack the ref. The quarterback defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and the quarterback signals for a hurry up offense. Hey, Glenn, what's the hurry up offense? There's no huddle. The offense. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Monty finds his head. They stump the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. down and nine and the offense quickly calls their second time out that's how you do it do what and the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game and he finds open space is running toward the end zone turn on your jets you son of a bitch First and ten. Hot one. Hot. And they run it for a couple of yards. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck! The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot... At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsanto Industries. Makers of great killer products like Groundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Oh, well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull Slappin' Vodka Jello shot day. They'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. Kick and recovery by the kicking team. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. Hot. And then pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? First and ten. Hot one. Hot. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this kid. And he's running like a moose. Oh, man, he just crushed him. 
I gotta see that again. I had a kid once like that walking down the sidewalk, texting with his earbuds in. Freaked him out. He said, hey, what'd you do that for? I said, I did you a lesson. What lesson, he said? That unless you're a baboon with big baboon balls, you gotta pay attention. Yeah, along the jungle, you know? Second down in a very lot. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All he need is 77 to bite it. And like a monkey trying to fall oh, with the... Oh, man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the ref didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Oh, man, what a throw. Oh, big catch. Big run. Big touchdown. Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brave Man with a ball and didn't fall out. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. <laughs> when you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Ah, another interception. Geez, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Hot, 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 hot. Oh, I'm good. 
Third down and forever. Hot one, hot two, hot two. And he was stuck to him like glue. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Just knocked him into the next time zone. Lucky find his head. He'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And he breaks away. He could go all the way. He's at the 30. Here comes the defense. He could go all the way. Yeah, never mind. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the QB might as well just bury him. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new? And like Rex's bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Rex. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Rex. You're an idiot. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap. The micro hard mutilators were soundly mutilated today and forfeit the game. It's probably a good thing the game ended up in forfeit. They weren't going to make it out of the stadium alive with this performance anyway. The fans were going to kill them if the opposition didn't. Gotta love that fan passion. Let's hear what the game's MVP has to say about this carnage. I'd rather listen to Sarah Balin read the entire works of Shakespeare while tripping my brains out. Uh, actually, that sounds kind of fun. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.